Hello, my name is Xfibo and I welcome you to my most ambitious ARC project ever. There is so much more to this video than what you just saw in this intro and I guarantee you enjoy every second of it. Everything you see in this video except the cinematics is recorded on MTS over the course of 39 real life days. Let's go. We started our journey in this little stone 2x2, which was almost immediately replaced by a metal 2x2 on top of one of the nearby pillars. This is where we made our first turrets and spent our first few days. Things were going great, and before I continue, I would like to tell you about today's video sponsor, xfibuclothing.com. We really wanted to build inside the freshly reworked skeleton cave in Viking Bay, but by the time we felt safe enough to move there, someone had already taken it. We saw this as a great opportunity for some PvP, so we went to the Lava Golem to get some better gear and weapons before we attacked them. Oh, there's a guy, there's a guy with a compound ball running to... Have a in, in, in it. No, he's running to it. Board him. He's dead. Give it Vitor. Who's he now? He did have a below, yes. He did? Yeah, he did. And Mad Bruce and a compound bow. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm coming, I'm coming. There's another guy. I'm bowled. I'm out of the bowler. He has a rocket launcher, what a guy. Here. Oh, it's a... It's a homing rocket. I made a primitive fabby, got my set of luck, grabbed the Bloodstalker and I went back there. I was not losing this battle. Yeah, I see him, I see him as well. He's got him. He's boarded. Kill him. This guy should have the pillow and stuff. Yeah, he has it all. He has it all. All the blueprints as well. Are you covering? Yeah. Uh, I can't. I can't carry more. Okay, I'll, I'll take the rest. Yeah, you take the rest. Wait, there's a guy. There's a guy running. Come, come after me. He's in here. Uh, he's bowling. Okay. Got him. Good. Another fellow. And a good better shotgun. And a ascending crossbow. Yeah, that, that was him, that was him, I think. Before we fought the guys in the skeleton cave, we wanted to upgrade our base first. I made a few normal turrets, Anton made a few heavies, we placed them down, and now it was time for some action.
Wait for wait 30 seconds for this one to um, power and then move up the other one. Uh, how are you not getting shot? Oh, you are. What's your HP at? 4.5. That's a dead guy. Wait, can I let, let me let me post Boston there real quick? So, oh, uh, first try. Oh, what a grapple! First what try. a grapple! Wait, move, 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 move. I'm gonna rock. Yeah, it's destroyed. Oh, there is destroyed. Jen's down. Chew, chew, chew. He bowled me. There's turrets up there, watch out. Yeah, I'm running up here with a Sega. I broke their beds, I broke their beds. Very nice. Wait, I think the stick was I think they're out of the wool bullets. Yeah. I I broke no, I broke the chain. They're, they're down, they're down, they're down, they're down. I broke the box. Fabricator. This is not bad. Oh forge is full of metal. Oh, there's a storage box down there. Yeah, I saw that as well. Nah, no way, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. What? <laughs> nah. No way! Easy game. <laughs> so that's, oh, they picked, they picked it up. Oh, they did, yes. After we wrapped up the raid, we did the Ragnarok boss fight where this happened. Oh my god, I love you. Come here, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss, take off your helmet. I said take off your helmet! Come over here. Give me a kiss. What is wrong? Ah, he's gone! <laughs> he's gone! And this is how we concluded day 3. On the next day, I went out on a little 5 day vacation to the Bulgarian seaside. And by the time I came back the tribe had made huge progress and now we had two bases on Genesis 2. One was on the needle, and the other one was inside the water bubble. We also had claimed and started building the Peru cave on the center, which would turn out to be our main base for the rest of the wipe. On the same day, we went for a quick raid. We saw the turrets of this cliff base when I realized I didn't have my OBS on. But the loot was pretty good, so here it is. But um, yeah, we saw it all. We got in, got the door, took out the element from the Jenny, and uh, waiting for it to power down the turrets. But basically, what we go from them is a poison every once in a while, three acid officers take balls, and in here, I think it's all the cryos. No, well, we took them. I'm gonna show them to you in a bit. Pretty much, they had a few turtles, a lot of wyverns, uh, which uh, Nexus uploaded. We got Villos, uh, nothing really special, no gigas or anything, but just a bunch of useful dinos. Uh, we'll go through the vaults now. See what we can find in there. Okay. This vault has a bunch of weapons. Six thirty one dura leggings. A rock rock golem. Level two seventy thirty K HP on it. Three more C four. Oh yeah, a mech down below. That's huge as well. Just another May Wing, another. Yeah, 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 it's a prim one. It's level 51. Oh yeah, that is good. Holy. 
that's huge actually. After this raid we decided it was time to fully move into our Pearl Cave, but we kept both bases on Genesis 2 because ever since it came out I've been very excited to do the boss. I didn't watch any videos about it because I wanted to keep my reaction as authentic as possible, so me and two other tribe mates ventured out to do all the beta missions, which turned out to be a bit harder than expected, but we did it nonetheless. Nah, I'm gone. That's the canoe gone. Uh. Bro, if I fail this now, I'll, I'll, yeah, gone. Fuck the boost. Boost only put me in rock, rock, only kill canoe. Canoe gone. Makes you go sad. Now he's gonna be like, nope, shield. Oh. Okay, we got him. <laughs> what to do? Hey, we did it. Hey. And now it was time for Island Ascension, or not. So close. Back. After I kill him, I need to be careful and get away. Actually, I'll kill him from far away. Kill him. Oh! Holy, that explosion actually kills you. These missions took a few days to complete, and once I was done with them, we only needed mutagen to start the boss. As some of you may know, farming mutagen is a long and tedious process, so I decided on doing something else from time to time. I messaged my good friend Simplex asking him about his giga melee, and we set up a trade. Bro, my wings. So quick. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there is the skin. Uh, it's okay. Yeah, here, and you can have this combo, but you probably can't. No, I can't. You gotta buy it. Uh, I can drop this here. Do you have it? Uh, okay, let me upload all of those. And now it's time to introduce you to our main rivals. A few nights in a row, a tribe was constantly trying to raid us, but our tribe mate Fowin was always there to defend. Let's just say I was very excited when I found out who was trying to raid us. The sweet wait stegos. Before we continue, I would like to say that me and Clement are good friends and that there's no beef between us. We love battling in game, go subscribe to him. He can definitely get them that way. Uh, but he'll have zero everything else. He'll have zero movement speed and like all. He'll have like the only way that's it. He's back here with gravity grenades, so watch out. Shade, you've been Whoa, you just got sucked in there, boy. He's spamming them like crazy. Oh, run, Dipsy. How the fuck are you alive, Dipsy? I popped a beer. <laughs> What's he doing? What's his plan here? I don't know. I'm trying to look for him to see what he's doing. Ah, chain bowl, huh? That's <laughs> smart. He's using his brain again, boys. <laughs> Who just died? Did he die? Did he? He just died. Wait, how? He yeah, did he die. He did, he did, he did. He did. No, he, he's dead, dead. he's dead. How did he die? He, he ate a poly. He went to switch to the gravity grenades and probably ate a poly. Yeah. Oh, he just looks back at his wall. I'm stunned. He's close. He ran up. He ran up. Let's do something. Oh, there he is. Zed. Zed. I can comp it off the back of my Sego. It's almost dead. Dead. Nice. There's three of us, dude. This is disgusting, man. This. There's one of him and he can't do anything. Bro, why? Well, like, okay, no, I disagree with the nerf now. This is. The, it was nerfed way too much. Three stegos being able to soak a wall and like a pro cave? Come yeah. on. Like, what the hell is this? 
This is bad. Like, this is bad, man. This is... We are soaking so much right now. Add that UD to the equation. Who is it, though? Like, who is it? Falwyn. Falwyn is their main defender of the Pearl Cave. This guy doesn't know what to do anymore. I feel bad. I, I hate I hate this situation. No, no, no. I'm dead. I don't have beer. You're good, How the fuck am I alive right now? It's feared. It's feared. Stegos are so balanced. What is that? Pitch now. Oh. <laughs> oh, watch out on the that's UD. Gonna, that's gonna hurt the that. UD, yeah. Get back Hi. up the UD. Yo! Sheesh! Sheesh! <laughs> no! Uh, you got a problem, Chief. When I get in that far, he has a real problem, boys. Why? Because we're the wall's almost gone now. Just spam fear. I think uh, they ran out of crabs, boys. I've come to the conclusion. Give me two seconds, please. Or they're saving it for the choke point now. Oh, he drowned it. Oh, really? It. Yeah. Damn, that's yeah, smart. The car key with the water the Yo, car this guy, this guy, honestly, man, he's fucking smart, dude. Like, he's a good ass tribe, man. Most people wouldn't know what the fuck to do right now. So yeah, Fowin really is a good tribe mate. Some other thing I should mention, at the time of their attack, Clement did not know he was raiding my tribe. Anyway, Fowin managed to push them off, and now it was time for our second attempt at Island Ascension, and also our second attempt at doing the Genesis 2 boss fight, because we failed it once due to lack of knowledge. Let's give it another go boys, see what happens this time. First time we failed it, this time hopefully we'll make it. Okay, so in this first part you have to kill a set amount of tentacles, after which a nexomech will spawn for you and you use it to kill 4 nodes. I'm gonna go to the right. It's more that way. 
It's right here, Jerry. Yeah. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go. Yeah, there we go. Investigation done. Now wait for him quick. This is the second stage in which we found a spot where we were not getting hit by the tentacles, but you should still be careful when doing this because these spiky things that are coming from the ground are dangerous and destroy your armor. Once in that stage, you should shoot straight for Rockwell with your tech rifle. We're getting close, boys. We are getting close. Oi, almost got hit by that. Two more, two more clips maybe? One more clip, we'll see now. Okay, this is it boys. Once my shots hit. this possibility. I must have missed a transform on the 15th statistical outcome matrix. Uh, simply put, Rockwell's embedded himself too deeply into the ship's primary systems. They're failing along with him. There's only one way to ensure this all ends here. Sorry, mate. I can't come with. And I'm almost out of time to back myself up. You'll do just fine on your own out there. You're a survivor. Why are you still here? Staying behind to gloat? Edmund. I'm here to help you end this nightmare. You did this to me for wanting the same power she squandered. Well, I've survived worse. I promise you I will find a way out of this. I will. No, you won't. It's much too late for that. It's so bright. Helena? I'm afraid. Shh. She knew. Survivor, this is my last message to you to be relayed in the event of my deactivation. I was only an artificial construct when we first met. Just a shadow of someone who lived a long time ago. But in our time together, I got to become something new. Someone new. Not Helena. 
HLNA. Thank you for that. I wish I could find the words to tell you how much it meant to me. <sighs> Human language is so imprecise. But I need you to do something else now. Find your own path. Your own destiny. Build a new world here. A better world. And who knows? Maybe two lost souls can still meet again somewhere. Out among the stars. Goodbye, my friend. It's incredible how far this game has come. <clears throat> oh, there's more. This some hint to arc two, maybe? Warning. Catastrophic fire viability. Yes. Respawned again. Insertion limit is successful. Stable orbit confirmed. Warning. Emergency evacuation in progress. Docking clients released. Drop initiated. Looking forward to that. Every time I make a video I always shorten everything so there are no so-called boring parts. But uh, you guys will allow me this one time to have something not so cool on. The guys on your screen, no matter how many times you've disliked what they've done, have restlessly worked on this game that we love and enjoy. And um, to everyone at Sudi Wildcard, this moment is for you. Thank you for this incredible journey. Anyway, enough sweet talk. We have enemies to deal with. Ah, uh, there's a Giga, and a Wyvern, and a Bloodstalker. Might be Clement. Dipsy, 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 it's dipsy. It is Clement. I don't know if you guys heard already, if I told you in the video, but um, Clement's tribe has been trying to raid us every single night, or almost every single night, for like five nights now. And um, yeah, this is getting out of control now. He said that he cannot control his tribe and stuff, so uh, I guess this is a war. And uh, they came to our base one too many times. I think we should go set up the heavy like right there, like in front of it. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll give you diving. Okay, follow me, follow me, follow me. We're gonna go hard left. Here. That way. You coming? Yeah. I see one of them. Two gigas, two gigas, two gigas. Oh, they have heavies, they have heavies on the thing. On the thing that I wanted to place my our heavies on. I can kill the guy on the gig right now, are you ready? Ready to shoot? No. Tell me when you're ready. No. Please. Killed one, killed one. Should I? Do you want to pop gigas at the drop? Ah, they have heavies there, they have heavies. And a Void Wyvern as well. He's coming with the Void Wyvern. Lag. 
I'm unmounted. Careful for the giggle. Ah, that's, that's dead. That Blitzstalker's gone. You're on a pop kick. Oh, no. I'm dead here. Or not. Pop your kick up, pop your kick up, pop your kick up. I'm dead, I got Pop your kick. Nice. Just pop the She's She's gonna raid any second. I'm unmounted. I didn't this man. He's giga right, he's right, he's right. Nice, 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 yeah, nice, nice. We saw Nitro, we saw Nitro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, there's another one there. Fucking this is annoying with this Void Warren. Yeah, that's the, that's the worst part. We got absolutely destroyed there, and by the time I got another kit and went back, they had already finished the drop and left. But I kept looking for people to counter on Extinction, and I found these poor boys over here. This is incredible. I eight clipped the kid and he's still Oh for the tube. Holy! <laughs> I have no idea what just happened. Who am I? Mr. Sanchez? A oh god. <laughs> Ten minutes later, I came back here and they were now attempting the drop. Ah, two gigas though. Oh, he's stuck in that gig. That's the guy without the legs. No. Get him a couple of times on the giga thing. I killed him off the Giga. One guy. Go and try and bite the Giga. Try and bite the Giga from one here. There's turrets there, be careful. Yeah, I know. Oh no, that's bad. 
That's really bad. Can you pick him off, maybe? No? Oh, very good, very good, very good. Did he upload it? He did, yes. We may have won the fight over these guys, but the feeling was bittersweet. We won against these guys, but we lost against Clement. So, on the next day, we decided it was time for us to show up at their base for once. We started by soaking their turret tower, which we did for almost an hour without anyone coming out to fight us. And once they did come out... He's up, he's up, he's up, he's up, he's up. Chew. You're netted. Kill him. Nice, nice. We showed them that we were there to win. Get that whole kit, get that whole kit. Take over and put it in the middle. Ah, I think he's up, he's up, uh, like right across from us, guys. Do you see their cliff plats up high above? Yes. That's where he is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's up and down. Choo, 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 choo. Let me go behind him. Get ready with the, the, the wyvern is up on those cliff plats across. He knows, he knows, he knows, he knows, he knows, he knows about me. No, I'm dead. Go up there, please. I'll carry you X with him. I got my kit. There's a Giga. There's a Giga. Oh, oh, there's a car right here at the floor. Yeah, Giga, Giga, Giga. I'll come pick him with the thing. Pick them off, pick them off, pick them off. Pick them off of what? Of the Giga. Oh no. I got TP back. Hey, jump on your Giga. There's a guy right here on foot, right here on foot. Actually, he's gonna try to pick. I'm coming. Drop him, drop him to me, drop him to me, drop him to me. Rosen, on me, on me. I can't, I can't, I'm out of stamina. Okay, okay. I've had the giga, I've had the giga. Nice, 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 nice. Let me check Sado. 98 Sado. We won this one. But we will be back tomorrow with the proper fob and the real raid attempt. We safely went back to base and we came up with a plan for tomorrow. We made our main fob with all of our gear needed for the raid in an underwater vacuum compartment far far away from their base. At their base we had a teleporter and turret setup. It was time for some real action. But this time they were faster with their response. Oh, they're actually fortniting like crazy, bro. Yeah. It's gonna be a fun one. Yes, sir. It's it's yes, a, it's sir. It's a big pop, bro. Who is it? He next to us, bro. Oh, yeah. I don't blame him, bro. To be honest with you. Dude, good on Dude, what do they pop? Desert crack? Yeah. They have a TP. They have a TP. Yeah. So their main fob is somewhere else. Full life. Everything's soaked, bro. They have like no bullets here. Hello, my friends. Hello, hello. I love you guys. Those are some big ass motherfucking gigas. Goodbye.
I just need shards and air be here now. We need to move turrets up here. I just want to keep them down here for now. The tech turrets on only survivors. I'm going to vault drop the gen. Thank God. One try, one try, baby. And right on the gen. He's gonna try and place a threat. On it. Yeah, he got detected. No legs on him. Killed one, killed one, killed one. You can grapple him. He's on the left. The pod coming up behind you. Thanks, uh, goodbye. Where? On top of the hill from right now. From your side? Uh, below me now. Can you snow up? Slow, slow, slow. Slow him. He's netted. He's netted. Okay, he's dead. He's... Well, there, come. Fifty buff, fifty buff, fifty buff. He's gonna rage, he's gonna rage, he's gonna rage. There's no way that happened. Who, who's up above? Who's up above? On foot. They shot, they shot gun in my wife. Killed one, killed one. That gun one here, here. Got him. Good shit, I'm, I'm here with you. There's another one down here. Another dead body down there. I can take what? stuff. Yeah. Take from this guy or take from the other. Okay, let's get. Oh, did you loot this guy? Yeah, I loot that one. Oh, okay, perfect, perfect. Nice, yeah, good. Who's rocketing? Or ask you? Me. Ooh! It's me. Ooh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, stop maybe. Stop stacking. Doesn't matter, he takes like a little damage. Nice, no, good. Hey, get the um, turret off the right. Back to it on the right. Good now, good now, nice. Yup. Is he down? Nice. At this point, it was already 6 am and we decided to retreat. But this wouldn't be our last attempt. We are raiding these guys one way or another. When I logged on the next day, the boys had already started a raid on a small center at Ho, and the people inside play a big role towards the end of our journey. There were two players online and uh, I believe uh, we caged one of them. So yeah, let's see if we can get inside here. Keep doing what you're doing. Wait, keep hitting that, keep hitting that. 
Oh, you're hitting the wall to the right of it. And he's right behind it. So once you get it, keep shooting. You need to get that other wall. And then we're at the Jenny. You're, no, you're running up to the railings and blowing the wall on the right of them. No chance. You gotta jump through the third toe. Wait, genie. so you could just walk in there then? The genie's at the back, the genie's at the back. Oof. Okay, <laughs> dude, that was like a quad kill. Oh. It was time to take care of Clement's tribe once and for all. But once we got there, another tribe saw us raiding. It was Hello Koto. Later on we found out that at the same time we were raiding Clement's desert crack, Hello Koto were raiding their carn cave and managed to cage four members of Clement's tribe. That demotivated them so much, there was no one defending the desert crack. We finally got rid of them. The guy that was online kept turning on and off the generator and we used the off time to throw tech grenades at the turret wall, destroying many turrets that way. Also, here is what we got from the raid. I'm gonna show you what we got from last night's raid on Clement's tribe. Uh, there's still mutagen in here. There's more as well. Uh, 
We got a bunch of eggs from them. Mainly blue soccer eggs and uh, Valansor ones. We also got a bunch of weapons from them. As well as uh, some of their armor. A bunch of their BPs as well. Uh, a lot of C4 here. More turrets. A few void worms. Which are only usable in Gen 2 now. Which is good because they were very bad. Some of their gigas as well. Manas, Velanasaurs, Mantises, and a rock column over here. <sighs> you guys thought that was it? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Hello, Koto knew we raided Clemens Desert Crack. And Hello, Koto wanted the loot from the Desert Crack. So, they came to try and get it. That's a good fault that they have. What tribe is that? Hello, Karen. No way. One of them's dead at the cliff plan. Holy. Yeah. Uh, 87 C4. Text you, is that you with the text you? Yeah, I, I could drop on him. I got it net. I'm netted myself. Probably dead here. They destroy our cliff class here. Yeah. Oh, I'm dead. Put the guy off it. Oh, wait, no. You got the whole thing? Oh my. I netted it. Netted the stalker as well. Netted the guy off the blast stalker. Jumped off, he ran past you. I got him. Ah, oh, fuck. Now it's that far again. Oh. Yeah, you can crash around. Oh, fuck. Netted the plus soaker again, but I'm fucking blind. Need help here. Can we. Is there anyone to kill? Anything to kill us? Yeah. I have nothing right now. Should I it? I just took off. I'm netted. Let's try. Hit it. I'm good though. Uh, Bloodsmoke is net. Oh, Z. That's you, Jesus. 
Netted, 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 netted. It's already been netted. Got it. Oh. There's about three people. Shotgun it. Shotgun it. Almost dead. A one. Dead. That was it. One, one person is right. One person is right here. In part Y. Part Y. Part Y. Where? In part Y. He's dead. Oh, come on. Yeah. Come on. He's in part Y. Netted. I'm good. I'm dead. Got one netted. I got it, I got it. Where is it? This bitch grappled. This bitch really They got rid of our outside tower pretty quickly, but they were unable to push us so they can start soaking, and that actually made them quit. We found out that their main fob was inside the bear cave, so um, we went there for some fun. There we go. Oh, oh, that's all it's a Kind of a professional, it's not a video. Whatever. Just doing stuff all day. Yeah, I respect it, Xiva. I fucking respect it. Chill, chill, turtle. Ah, yeah, Man, boys. All right, so you're gonna try to shoot out of. He's funny. God, we fucking made it. Sapajar actually did some. On the next day, we discovered that they got so demotivated that they just despawned everything they had in their base and quit. We went over there to solidify our victory over every enemy we had this wipe. I made it. Oh no no no! It's glitched. Oh, it... it's blowing like <laughs> one at a time. What is going on? <laughs> Everything is lagging. Oh yeah, the whole fucking server is lagging. One more C4 and I'm fucking dead. My clack is broken, fully broken. No! Oh my... How did I... Guys, I needed to get me some flak here and maybe some C4. Oh, oh! Oh! Pfft. Nice! There should be bags on the ground with the highest turrets. And just like that, we've made it to the end of our journey. We gave our base away to the guys that we raided in the small rat hole, and this was honestly one of my best swipes ever and I really wanted to represent that in the video. The battles and rivalries we had this swipe were amazing and I want to thank all our enemies for putting up such a great fight. As I said in the beginning, this was one of my biggest projects ever and I loved working on it. I sincerely hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, I will see you in the next one.